Hey guys, what's up? This is Alex. Bethesda's E3 press conference gave us a small look at the upcoming three DLCs, with one coming out every month until August. The first one is called Contraptions Workshop, which is coming out tomorrow, June 14th. If you own the Season Pass, this will be a free update and $5 for those who don't own the Season Pass. I'll be talking a bit more about this one at the end of the video, but let's see what else is coming. In July we get the vault Workshop DLC, which will have the same pricing as the Contraptions Workshop and will let you build your own vaults, customize them and run experiments on your dwellers. It will be interesting to see what these experiments will look like and how complex you can make your vaults. They seem to have integrated some elements from Fallout Shelter as well with the side views, which looks really cool and should make even bigger vaults overseeable. The last new DLC that was announced is the Nuka World, which is coming in August and will go for $20. This amusement park expansion will let us explore a whole new region of the map and will span over different theme park zones. Since this DLC is a little pricier, it also comes with new quests, weapons, creatures and raiders. This sounds like a whole lot of fun for the next few months and with mods to build upon these new DLCs, there will be tons of exciting new content to play. But let's take a quick look at the Contraptions Workshop that is out tomorrow. Like in the first Workshop DLC, it doesn't contain new story elements and is meant to extend your settlements and crafting experience. At the heart of it, it seems to focus on the factory aspect the most. You can now automate crafting processes that you would usually gather throughout the world. You can set up conveyor belts connecting different areas and build elevators for huge factory buildings. There's also new scaffolding kits that you can combine with the track kits, which let you build crazy structures that I'm excited to try out. At the moment I'm not too sure what the exact use or benefit is, but we will find out in a few hours. Aside from logic gates that will be one of the more complex gadgets, there's also new kits for building a greenhouse, warehouse, new armor racks and even fireworks. We hope to see you guys in the next few days for our coverage of the Contraptions DLC. Thanks for watching guys and see you next time.